learning the home row keys. In this lesson, we will learn the home row keys. You can think of the home row keys as our starting point or base. The home row is where we will always place our fingers when we type. From the home row, we can reach all of the keys with a specific finger. Our fingers will always return to the home row after we press any key. The keys we will learn in the home row are A, S, D, F, J, K, L, semicolon. We will always start by placing, not pressing, our fingers on the following keys. The left pinky finger will be on the A key. The left ring finger will be on the S key. The left middle finger will be on the D key. The left index finger will be on the F key. The right index finger will be on the J key. The right middle finger will be on the K key. The right ring finger will be on the L key. The right pinky finger will be on the semicolon key. Both thumbs will be on the spacebar. When you place your fingers on the home row, your hand should be slightly curved. Your left thumb should rest on the spacebar somewhere within the C and V key. Your right thumb should rest on the spacebar somewhere within the N and M keys. It is not necessary to press the spacebar with both thumbs simultaneously. Just one thumb will do. You might notice on most keyboards that there are little bumps on the F and J keys. These bumps are purposely designed on the keyboard so that you will know when you are on the home row. Practice typing the A key in the box below. Practice typing the S key in the box below. Practice typing the D key in the box below. Practice typing the F key in the box below. Practice typing the J key in the box below. Practice typing the K key in the box below. Practice typing the L key in the box below. Practice typing the semicolon key in the box below. Type this and include the spaces with the spacebar. A space D space J space F space semicolon space A space L space 
S space K space J 